we'll guide you through how to find the max RAM capacity in Windows. If you find this guide useful, then please consider subscribing and liking the video. So there are a couple of different things I like to do to go and find this out. First of all though, we need to open up command prompt. So click on search at the bottom and type it in just like so. And the command that we need to go and enter is WMIC space mem mem physical phys ical and that's all one phrase there then space and get and space again and then type in max capacity just like so which is one phrase like that then go and press enter and you go and get this response now this response is in uh, kilobytes so to go and convert this to gigabytes we'll need to go and open a calculator and we'll go and type that in. I've now typed it in and you need to go and divide it by 1024 to convert it to megabytes and then divide it again by 1024 to go and get it into gigabytes. So the answer here is 128 gigabytes. So go and note that down. But what I also like to do is go and check the capacity of the motherboard itself because sometimes that can be different. So what I'm now gonna do is go and close off the calculator, find out what motherboard you've got. To do that, you just come and click on search and type on system information like so. Come down to your base board manufacturer and product. So I've got a MicroStar International, AKA MSI Pro X670-P. This is what I typed in here, the motherboard and then RAM capacity. And then we can go to the motherboard website. We can then scroll down to product specifications and we can find out the max here is 192 gigabytes. But as we just checked, the max Windows can handle is 128. When you've got two different numbers here, I would just go for the lower one to play it safe. So in this case, I'd upgrade my system to up to 128 gigabytes. 